Hey Playmates! So for today's video, I'm gonna show you how to catch Play Together new insects. Let's start with the insects can found in the trees or woods. As you observe, this kind of insects usually produce a loud sound. So whenever you hear this sound, it means there is a horse cicada just near you. Also be careful to do not detect by the insect. If your target insect is in the tree, you should know the right distance when to release your net. It should not be too far from your target or else it might escape. Did you hear that? Min Min Cicada sound is different from horse cicada. So whenever you will hear this sound, it means there is a Min Min Cicada around. Sometimes you need to stop a bit from walking and then try to walk again very slowly just to make sure it will not detect you. sound produced by the large brown cicada. As you heard a while ago, cicada insects have different sound produced. Same with catching a beetle. You should be careful and walk slowly. Your target insect is in this kind of location, you should be extra careful. As I said a while ago, the distance of your net before you release it should not be too far or too close to your target. Don't rush it, you should estimate the distance first. If you want to catch this insect, you have to be careful while moving because it doesn't stay in one place only. I will also teach you some technique that you may do to easily catch an insect in the tree. As you can see, there is a ladybug attached behind this tree. And now, I'm gonna try to catch it. Now, I'm gonna try to catch this one. Of course, you should remember first which tree you saw the insect. Then, hold your net and walk slowly towards it. Still, you need to consider the distance of your net to your target insect. Another one, I'm gonna try to catch this so sad beetle. Even if the insect is attached behind the tree, it can still detect you. So avoid running towards it and maintain to be careful catching it. The grass. This insect is very sneaky, so if you want to catch it, you should point your direction towards to it 
and then continuously walk slowly. For me, this is one of the easiest insect to catch because it's not as sneaky as the jumping spider. This insect can be very sneaky too because it suddenly jumps around. You should be extra focused to catch it immediately. Same goes to this following insect. Here. Since it's moving slow, you don't have to be careful just to catch it. This insect is also very challenging to catch. You need to wait for the right timing before you get close to it. As you're getting close while moving slowly, aim to the right direction where you can catch it. This insect is the most difficult to catch since it is very small and it can also bite you. You should make sure that it will not detect you by moving slowly a bit by bit. Once you're already close, wait for it to come near you before you catch it. Next are the insects can found in all areas. Catching this insect will be extra challenge since it is flying around. As usual, you need to walk slowly towards it and wait for it to come near you. Well, these flying insects can be very challenging to catch if you will let them detect you. Catch this insect, try to wait for it to stay in one position as it comes near you. Last but not the least is the insect can found near the street light. The same on how you catch mosquito and other butterflies here. You need to move slowly a bit by bit. As much as possible, don't run towards it because it can be very sneaky. Watch its direction and wait for the right timing when you can catch it. Estimate your position towards the insect you want to catch. You just need to let it fly around you for a several seconds. Then when it comes towards you, and that will be the right timing to catch it. As of the moment, here are all the insects I've got. Still looking forward to catch the rare ones soon. helps you. Thank you for watching. Bye!